I hope that you and your family will enjoy a special Memorial Day weekend together as we kick off these warm, hot days of summer. But I hope that all of us will also take time to remember those who have served our country, especially those who have paid the ultimate sacrifice this Memorial Day weekend. If you know a veteran or someone who is active duty or in the Guard or Reserve, I hope you'll also take time to thank them and thank their families for the sacrifices that they have made so that we all can enjoy the great freedoms that we do as Americans. I also hope that as we think about helping our veterans and those who serve our country, you'll know that I want to do everything we can here in Washington to stand up for those serving in our military with their pay, with their benefits, with their health care, and honoring their service and their families back home. Also, we want to make sure we're honoring our veterans and those who have served our country to make sure they get the health care that they have earned and deserve. In fact, I've been real thrilled that recently that we have been able to announce the new Brunswick County Veterans Outpatient Clinic that will be opening, we hope, later this summer. And we are looking forward to being able to serve the veterans in Brunswick County in that special way. And also we're looking forward to the new Super Regional Clinic that will be opening in Wilmington that will serve a vast area of southeastern North Carolina, several counties where veterans can come and get special additional attention that they may need. You see, in every way, we should always be looking for ways to help our veterans who have honored all of us by the sacrifices they have made. So have a happy and a safe Memorial Day. Enjoy your time with your family. And please pause to thank God for this great country and to thank a veteran for their great service and for those who are currently serving. God bless you and have a great weekend.